What's up, everybody? Afro Joe here again. I know y'all getting tired of this whole Zimmerman bullshit, but everybody heard about George Zimmerman say somebody. He came out of hiding to save some people that was in the wreck. Now, this kind of threw me off. Like, this guy, this guy was <laughs> in hiding because he killed somebody. And got out of, got out of it. He got, he didn't get convicted. He didn't get put in prison. Everybody heard that he's walking, but it just showed that he saved somebody. Now, why would you come out of hiding after your life is in danger to save somebody else's life and trying to redeem yourself in the people's eye? See, they didn't put no, put no evidence, no nothing, and show that this guy really did it. See, that's what. See, that's one thing I hate about the media because they twisting everything into a point where they are getting people hating on people. Like everybody's looking at this whole thing as a racial issue about him walking. Well, can't blame him, but can't blame him. But it is what it is. You got the people sitting up there pissed off and all this and this and that about the verdict. But like I said, man, he comes out of hiding to save somebody's life. Now this is like it, it, it throws me off. You go in and hiding after the verdict, you come out of hiding to save somebody. But you, for real, man, am I missing something right there? Did, did I miss something on the whole issues? Like, if you kill somebody, kill somebody and you just got, if you just <laughs> got found not guilty, how do you come out of hiding to save somebody else's life? You took a life, but you saved somebody else's life. I don't give a damn if you save somebody's life or not. You took a life. Doesn't matter if it's your mama's life or anybody else's, I'm glad you save a life. I'm glad. Applause. But when it comes down to it, you took somebody's life. Which makes no sense that you go into hiding because some people want to kill you. But you come out of hiding just to save somebody's life. Something ain't right here. And there's no proof to back it up to say that this guy really did it. On the whole saving somebody's life. But it's shut, there's evidence showing he took somebody's life because he had the gun. And it didn't make no, his stories didn't make no sense, but it it kind of blows blows my mind about this now. Now I don't like for y'all if y'all say uh, you need to get off of Zimmerman. Look for the people that support Zimmerman. In my eyes, your pet to be your baby killer. Yeah, <laughs> that's all it is. You're a baby killer. You you kill people, kids. You love killing kids. There's no ifs, ands, or buts around it. You love killing kids. If you support Zimmerman more than ever, if you got kids and somebody else and you support him, I'm for real, man. I, I, it just makes no sense that some dude's gonna sit there and found innocent that's in hiding for his life comes out of hiding to save somebody else's life. And there's nothing to back it up. So, oh, the show that he did this. No witnesses came forward. Nobody came out and said, oh, he did save my life. No, nothing. See, he already lied several times to. Already lied up several times about the killing Trayvon Martin. But now, he said he saved somebody. I was like, what's, what's another one? Am I missing something? That's how they, it's bullshit. It's bullshit. Y'all sitting on the news and all this and that. But I just want to put my opinions to it. That's what it's called. Opinions. Everybody's, if you live in the U.S. of A., you have an opinion, you have a mind, you have free will, but that's how it is. But tell me what you think. If you support Zimmerman, you're a baby killer, you're a pedophile, you're all this and that, because you don't mind for kids getting killed. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, that's all I have to say on this, but this has been Afro Joe 10, like a TIE is again. Tell me what you think. Follow me on Twitter at Afro Joe the Wookie. Follow me on Tumblr. For us, subscribe to my channel, CeeLo Jr. 2, CeeLo Jr. 3, and tell me what you think. Peace, love, and effort,